I'm in New Mexico. You're probably wondering how I got here. So let me tell you. So basically, I went to the airport and I hid in someone's luggage. And then all the security guards just put me onto the plane. Well, I got thrown around a bunch, but I'm in New Mexico now. So anyway, I'm a Bandelier National Monument. And I'm gonna see some cave dwellings. Right da -da -da -da. Alright, so this place is pretty cool, right? I got over there, there's like a bunch of cliffs with all those holes in it. Maybe I can make one of those for myself. I can be like one of those cliff, cliff dwellers, like of the ancient people. I can live off the land, live off the grid. I'm seeing these, like, these little room things here. Maybe they're like foundations for a house or something. But they're pretty cool. It looks a lot better than my house. My cardboard box, actually. And then over there, look, I see a cave dwelling. See, there's like holes in the rock. The ancient people would have lived in. Looks like this is a pretty soft plant right here. I think I'm gonna touch it. This thing's pretty cool right here, right? This thing's pretty cool. It's like a white rock. And there's a bunch of holes in it. And maybe I can store mac and cheese in there, huh? And I can make this into like a home for Mr. Mouse and Craig. Yeah! Hey, I'm in a cave dwelling. Say, check this out. It's pretty sick. I think this is gonna be my new house. This is gonna be a mac and cheese storage center. I think, I think this cave dwelling is a lot better than the last one because it's so big. See, there's this room, and then there's that room, and then there's one room over there. Pretty awesome, huh? Yeah. Maybe this could be the bathroom, though. There's like a pit in all here, right? Alright. Okay. Hey, so this is the biggest cave plot I've seen yet. Check this out. Anyways, yeah, I can stand it. It's good to use this one as a house instead. So that was some pretty cool cave drawings, y'all. Yeah, check it. There are more. Yeah. Right da 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 da. Alright, I'm kind of tired right now. I'm kind of tired, so I think I'm going to sit on this wall. Like, I, I don't know what the sign says, but I think it says, please sit on walls. Maybe I'll bring it home and keep it as a pet. Feed it some mac and cheese. Hey, six-year-old gang. Now, uh, after after uh, going out of the cave dwellings, I went to a few museums about some like Manhattan project and nuclear bombs and stuff. And now I'm a meow wolf. This is a crazy light, this crazy light and art exhibit. So let's see. This is kind of scary, you know. This house of no return or house of whatever and check this out I just went up this creepy staircase into this really mysterious like place I really want to investigate this a little more ready to do that really confusing so I don't I don't think I'll be leaving anytime soon. Alright, we got this and then we got a whole different hallway and then all these different hallways. We got all these different hallways and then there's like this mirror thing here and it's really creepy at all. So yeah. I'm in this mirror dimension right now. Check this out. See, I can see myself. Every single way I look. Mm. Um, see, you can.
apparently you even see the person who's filming right now. idea where I am right now. It looked like some sort of art exhibit or something. Check it out. Got the trophies, got the statues, some like glass stuff. Anyways, yeah. This is real good. I'm at the hotel now. Check it out. Okay. Wow. This is even like a divider thing. And then there's this couch thing. Cool stuff. And there's a closet and some random thing there. That looks pretty good. So I, I, give, I think I give this four stars, you know? I, in terms of like looks. Like, this part's got a different style than that part. And I, I think it looks pretty good. Hey, sexual gang. It's Friday and I just went river rafting. Alright? I went to like the Rio Grande or something like that. And I went river rafting and right now we're gonna eat some lunch at a ramen place. Right in it out! And look at this now, it's pretty awesome, huh? We're about like 10,000 feet off the ground. I think I can see my cardboard box from here. Anyway, that's a long way down, so it's a good thing I don't fall off. So after the tram ride, I'm at the hotel now. So I think it's pretty nice, but one thing is, why is there a window looking up into the hallway? It makes no sense at all. Anyways, let's go inside. All right, we got a couch here with a TV, with a lamp. Okay, let's check this out. Speak up. There's two TVs. Let's go. Mike, wait, that's a microwave. Refrigerator. Let's see if there's a refrigerator leads to another hallway. You know what? I can't open it. That's okay. Here is this sink. Okay, that looks pretty good. Right, let's check out the bathroom. All right, it's pretty nice, pretty nice. Hey, it's day, um, it's day three, I think, and I'm in Old Town. Check it out. It's like I went back in time. It's like back to the future. Right in it now. You can even see some cannons over there. Oh, these buildings look pretty old. I mean, like, check that one out. It's like it was made in like the ancient times, made out of like adobe or like mud or something that's like dried out. Pretty cool, huh? Hey, are those like chili pepper strings or something? I think maybe I'll go over there and eat some. Hey, sexual gang. I'm looking at a bunch of hissing cockroaches. <laughs> it's really disgusting, so... Yeah, I'm not gonna show you that ever again. I'm in the Mediterranean Garden now. Check it out. 
it's a it's a little humid in here since you're in like a giant enclosed building but it's basically the same temperature as outside because new mexico is just that hot I'm at a rock garden. See? It's a Japanese tea garden and it's pretty cool. And I found this bell over here and I'm gonna ring it. Honestly, it might hurt my ears because it's 10 times as loud, but who cares? It's worth it.